I'll teach my dog 100 words. I'll teach my dog 100 words. The first six words I'll teach my pup are dig a hole and fill it up. I'll teach him walk and run and then catch a ball. Now that makes ten. And Mr. Smith, who lives next door, will say, That's great! Can you teach him more? And then I'll teach him bark and beg and wag your tail and shake a leg and wash your ears and wash your toes and scratch your head and blow your nose. Then Mr. Smith will tell Miss Brown, This is the smartest dog in town. I won't stop there, no, not at all. I'll teach him big, I'll teach him small, and fat, and thin, and short, and tall, and dark, and light, and day, and night. And then Miss Brown will call Miss May. Come over right away, she'll say. This dog is learning chase the cat and climb the tree and things like that. Then we will give them more to see. Eat your food and follow me. Wow, we're up to 43. I'll teach him red and blue and green, the smartest dog we've ever seen. I'll teach him orange, purple, pink. That makes 49, I think. And then Miss May will call Mayor Mir. She'll call, please hurry over here. And then for Mr. Mir, the mayor, I'll teach my dog, now paint the chair. Paint the road from here to there. Paint Uncle Abner's underwear, but have a care. Don't paint the mayor. Then Mr. Mir, the mayor, will say, I'll make today a holiday, and everyone will come to see my amazing dog and me. We'll show them skate and kick the stone, jump the fishbowl, bring the bone, chew the boot, and hold the phone. Cut the grass. Shine my shoe, comb your hair, and clean the zoo. Now, brush the bear. That's 82. But that's not all my dog will do. He'll tickle the pig and kiss the goose. He'll feed the mouse and mop the moose. He'll toot a bugle, beat a drum. He'll stand on Uncle Abner's thumb. And then I'll teach him... Sing with the birds. Now there, that makes 100 words. My dog will learn those 100 words and how my friends will cheer. I'll teach my dog those 100 words. I think I'll start next year.